All right, Ben, it seems like we're telling you about ATM thefts every week. Here's a look at the latest theft surveillance video capturing two men struggling to load this one into a truck overnight in Warren. Coco McAvoy is live on Hoover near Nine Mile with what happened before they took off with this one. Coco? Yes, the surveillance video really shows exactly what happened. It appears that the guys first tried to break into the store using just tools, but then they decided to use a pickup truck. As you can see, they left behind a lot of damage. There's people out now measuring just to take in all of the damage that's left behind from the robbery this morning. And now police are trying to track down the suspects. Another early morning smash and grab in Warren. This time, the thieves pulled up in a red pickup truck outside of Joe's General Liquor Store. The surveillance video shows what happens next. Two guys jump out of the truck and one starts hammering away at the front door. They ditch that idea and instead decide to ram the truck into the front of the store repeatedly until they break in. Then the guys run into the store and come back out with a big ATM. They struggle with it for a bit and then get the ATM into the back of the truck. The thieves take off, leaving behind piles of rubble at the store. It follows a slew of other smash and grab robberies all over the Metro Detroit area. And now police are trying to figure out who is behind the targeted robberies. Because at this point, police are trying to figure out whether or not these recent robberies are all connected in some way. Of course, if you know anything, you're asked to call the Warren Police Department. Reporting live this afternoon, I'm Coco McAvoy, Local 4. Yeah, all right, Coco. They should be on the lookout for a couple of guys with back pain, as it appears. Thank you.